Today's review will be about the McNally Stromstick, which is probably one of the oldest drumsticks and certainly the originator of the, the form that we now know. This example is a Gra McNally Grand Stromstick in D and as you can see it's got a curl top uh, with some uh, inlay. The wood is product. The McNally Stromstick is a really fun instrument to play and it's very well constructed. It's, uh, it's nicely shaped on the back. The, the neck is a nice D profile. Um, note the interesting use of the zero fret in, uh, instead of a nut. It um, has the zero fret and up here has some nylon inserts um, which stop the wood from getting worn away. Overall it's a very streamlined, simple design. Um, it's very light. It's very resonant, it's quite loud. Uh, considering the size of the sound box, it, it's actually quite loud. Um, it's suitable for musicians as well as children and beginners. Um, the standard one is better probably for children, I would have thought. That the, it's slightly shorter and smaller scale and higher pitched. Uh, but this one, it's a good accessory for a dulcimer player um, or for a musician. You can also get them with chromatic scales. Um, the price of this one, which has a curl top, is around about 200, 270 US dollars. Um, but you can get them a lot cheaper. Uh, the plain ones with spruce tops are a lot cheaper. Um, but overall, I would definitely recommend this if you if you if you have that sort of money to play with, um, and you're looking for a stick dulcimer, and you can't make one uh, yourself, then I would definitely recommend the McNally Strum Stick. Um, it's a fine piece of instrument making and I think they're pretty much available everywhere now. Uh, uh, I mean, 10 years ago when I wanted to make one, uh, they weren't available in England, so I, I, I studied and looked at all different types that were available and made my own version. Um, 